Hi, and welcome to Colorlib Video Tutorial. In this video, I'm going to take you through the process of setting up your gallery with Pixova Lite using Gallery by Modula Plugin. To do this, navigate to your WordPress dashboard, then go to Appearance and select Customize. You will be redirected to this page. Under the menu to the left, you will see Gallery Photo, Gallery Image by Modula under Recommended Plugins. Click Install to proceed. The plugin will be installed and activated. Now, let's go back to the dashboard and open Modula on the bottom left by clicking on it. On the menu presented, select Add Gallery. Enter your gallery name and description. Description is only for internal use. You may want to change the gallery width and dimensions in pixels. Enter your new dimensions on the boxes provided here. Click Next to proceed. On the new window, choose how you want from your WordPress field for titles and captions displayed from the drop-down presented here. Click Next. Enter the minimum image width and height for your images. We suggest using the Short Pixel Image Optimization plugin to optimize your images and get the best possible search engine results and load speed. Click on Add Images to upload your images. Once done, click Save. You will see this pop-up message here saying your gallery photos has been created. Now, copy the code here and paste it on a page or a post. Let's paste it on a simple page here. To do this, go to Pages here on the Dashboard menu. On the new window, I will choose Sample Page by clicking on it. Next, I will paste the link on where I will want it to appear. For this sample, I will paste it top here. Once I am done, I will click Update. Now, let's view our image gallery by copying the permalink here and pasting it on the browser. This is a preview of how your image gallery will appear on your website page. You can go back and customize it until it suits your requirements. Congratulations, you have successfully installed and created your photo gallery using Modula plugin. This marks the end of our tutorial series on Pixova plugin. Thanks for walking with me all through to the end. For support on related questions, it is better to ask on support forum, as they have more knowledge than me at colorlib.com forward slash WP, forward slash forums, forward slash forum, forward slash Pixova Lite. This link is available below in the description area. Last but not least, thank you very much for watching and please subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep you up to date with the latest WordPress theme tutorials.